So we meet once again, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> today, we got another one of those videos. Like this video, subscribe if you're brand new, because today we are checking out Nuke's Top 5. Roll it. Not a helping hand. This next video was posted to Facebook by Marla Teixeira Hernandez from Richmond, California. California. Marla says that she was rearranging some furniture in her son's bedroom and recorded a video of the room's final look to show to her daughter. Oh, really? But when she watches her video back, she spots something downright chilling. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's not gonna end well. Famous last words, you know, makes the entire setup, and then when it's time to show. They see some else, some, some completely different though. Let's see. Yeah, 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 yeah. What? Marla says no. she was completely. I saw some like hand or something. Alone in the room when what appears to be like right here. Yeah, this one. A little hand. Yeah, what if it's a? Uh, what if it was like a cloth? What if it was like a like a like a dog or something? Can be seen moving behind her son's cabinets. Oh Even God. creepier. Viewers pointed out that a man's voice seems to quietly whisper, Don't be afraid to die. Nah, no. bruh, it was like, don't be afraid to uh, smash a like button. That's bruh. what it was saying, I think. Amara right, posted guys? the video to Facebook in hopes of getting any thoughts or ideas on what she might have captured. She says that other than one strange incident with a fan switch turning itself off and on in her son's room, she's never really experienced anything paranormal in the house. So what do you think this is? I, I think it was a hand of a chihuahua somehow. Like maybe they have small dogs with chihuahua, right? Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, could be that. Before we move on to the next video, I bet the very old video from the depths of the internet. Source unknown. Oh, so, red. A group of friends are hanging out, drinking and having a good time in the woods of Flacy, France. Suddenly, they spot what they believe to be a dog hiding behind a tree. Dog. The dog. Was it a dog? Oh, bouger. Oh, bouger. Et toi là, et toi là, et bouger. Okay, speaking the français right there. Truc là-bas. Attendez ici. Uh, minio minio, it just means nice, kind of like it's a word that, yeah, yeah. they use. Minio, minio. Putain! 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 <laughs> Yo! Il mignon, le chat. He's like, yeah, it means cute, exactly. So, minio, oh, ce chat là, c'est minio là. That means uh, that cat is very, very cute. Or, de, de, le chien là, c'est minio là. C'est minio, ce chien là. So he's a cute dog, he's a slightly big dog. Damn, might not be a dog then. Oh, I don't like that. I'm sorry. No! There's a... Oh, it's the fish of the gun. I think it's something else though. To protect the... Putain! Putain! No, it's something else, bro. Hands up in the air! Hands! Where I can see them. I'm going to film. Yo, it doesn't look like a dog, bro. Wow, wow, wow! Something otherworldly can be seen moving around behind the tree. Something with long fingers and an unusually large skeletal head. Nah, it's not a dog. The video bro. abruptly cuts, and what happens next remains a mystery. Oh, right. What so, could it be that happen? the group had an encounter with an alien? Or just what? <laughs> The Martians are here! Hide yourselves in the basement! Lock yourselves in the basement, I should say. Not hide. Locking is better than hiding, guys. Remember that. Smash the like button. But, uh, nah, it does look alien in nature, I would say that, but nah, bro, like, come on, bro, like, it's something else, bro, like, I, I do believe in aliens, but come on, bro. Putain, like, come on, la, ila, 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 toi la. Is. That. Let me know what you think. Yeah, the three fingers, kind of. It feels like three Hunting fingers. Hunting the unknown. Paranormal investigator Alex from the YouTube channel Hunting the Unknown sets out to investigate a restaurant in England that's been abandoned for over 20 years. The owners of the restaurant are said to have abruptly fled the property after being tormented by severe paranormal activity. The abandoned and broken down structure is located deep in the middle of the woods, and Alex is all alone 
as he begins his investigation. Yep, I'm never going to the woods ever again, bro. Why does it always have to be the woods, though? How many of you guys actually been to the woods and had, like, normal experience? How many of you actually had not-so-normal experience? I wanna know, though. Like, any of you have, like, a bad experience in the woods? I want to. I've never been, but I want to. But after... I have seen, like, so many of these videos, it's like listen to so many Mr. Bellin stories that I just don't want to. Like, you feel what I'm saying? Like, it's, uh, yeah, uh, no, man. In the dead of night, after setting up a motion detecting music box in the bar section of the restaurant, Alex already begins to experience strange activity. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've got the music box set up at the I've moment. i got the music box? Just do a little walk for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello? Camera one, it's gonna shut itself. Damn, so it did. Maybe it was a like a wind. camera captures the moment a door slams by itself. Maybe it was wind. It, it was the wind. Off. But things are about to get even weirder. Alex decides to do a spirit box session in the hopes of catching some paranormal activity. Where are you? Can you give me a sign, please? Yeah. What the? Alex asks for a sign, and bottles sitting on the bar seem to be pushed over on their own. Yeah, it was as but it's when like... he takes a closer look at the bottles that he captures something truly disturbing. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. So what is he gonna capture though? Like, is he gonna capture like a like a shivava? Like another, uh, uh, it's probably like a crackhead. Let's be real. It's like a whole lot of crackhead energy. I'm, I'm assuming like there's probably like so somebody was sitting back, right? Throwing like stones, like little stones. Maybe that's what it was. Maybe I just spoke too soon. Maybe I'm just joking way too much. Maybe it's some, some sinister, something sinister. Let's see. I don't understand how these were locked down. Bruh, 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 bruh. It's crazy. I don't understand this. I'm pretty sure this is like oh. that. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, It's still there. It's still there. It's gonna be scary. Yo, 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 yo. It's gonna be scary if it comes. I feel like that it was just walking, walking closer to him, though. He's getting closer. Bruh, bruh, bruh. Okay, not there. Not there. Oh shit, oh shit. Nah, he's just pointing the camera at him. Still there? I think it's still there. Okay, he's seen it. He did not freak out. He did not freak out. That's crazy though. Oh yeah, 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 Dog, 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 dog. Chill, bro, chill, bro. The dark silhouette of a figure can be seen standing in a room right across from Alex. Now, Alex doesn't notice the figure at first, but when he moves towards the door, he realizes that something is not quite right. Mm. He inspects the room to make sure no one is there, but he gets the unsettling feeling that he's being watched. Yeah, Alex no longer feels safe. And I feel like that we as humans, we have that, like, whatever you want to call it, right? Like, just let's just call it sensor. Bruh. We have sensor. Whenever somebody's, like, staring you, whenever somebody's, like, staring you, you just feel that someone is staring you. So, yeah, it, it, I feel like if you get that feeling, you're definitely going to look around, and I think this is what's happening to him, and... Mm, yeah, I feel him. I feel him on that. In the remote building, and all by himself so he decides to just get out of there you can watch this entire investigation and many more spooky videos over on the youtube channel hunting the unknown mm. the thing from the cave japanese paranormal investigators gachan daichan and yasuke are contacted by one of their viewers about a bizarre this is gonna be probably the best one, man. Japan and uh, like Arab areas uh, or Arabic areas, some of the best, man. Arabic, I wanna see some Arabic ghost hunting too, bruh. But Japan, okay. Let's Our get picture it. they took in an allegedly haunted cave in Fukuoka Prefecture, Japan. The picture shows what appears to be a woman peeking from a rock inside the caves. 
The location is set. That was definitely somebody in a Halloween costume, bro. Like, like, wasn't Halloween like just a couple of days ago? <laughs> it was somebody in the Halloween costume. Lock your kids, hide your kids, hide your wives. Do not let them get the candy. To be a paranormal hotspot, oh, and many right. visitors claim to have seen the mysterious apparition of a lady dressed all in white. Holy. It's late at night when the clip store team carefully make their way deep underground into the cave system to search for the spot where the photo was taken. Yes, yes, I'm just kidding. Okay, be careful. Oh, yes, it's a giant Should rock. I almost pushed a giant rock down there, bro. If you did that, my brother would be would be dead, though. He would be sent to heaven right then and there. Please don't. Yeah, I don't want to. It's like sitting on an Asian-style toilet. Brian, what? I'll kill you? Wait, what? Huh? Huh? Wait? Yo, they better see something. They better see like a head or something. Look at the left side. Oh, rip. Oh, rip. Oh, no. oh, oh, oh. There it is. There it is. Awful in there. It could have been a person. I thought that that was gonna be the ghost, or the ghost was gonna come from that way, but no, it's their homie. Your legs are sticking out. Anyway, it's definitely here. The clip store team manages to find the exact location of the photo. But now, with all three members so cramped in such a tiny cave tunnel, Yasuke and Daichan decide to head back out and wait in the car. Kachan stays behind to listen and look for anything strange. Bad idea! Bad idea! Mama always said that. Don't let leave your homies behind. Don't let your brother behind. Don't be alone, they said. Nah, bro. Th this is a recipe of disaster, though. Either they they made it up. I mean, Jap Japanese people, after all, they're like 500 IQ. So either they made like a very, very good fake or they really did us caught some for real. Uh, but being alone now, nah, bro, like, come on, bro. Like, you're not Mother Ter uh, Teresa or nah, bad, bad analogy, bad analogy. Like, but right? I'm thinking of someone else. Let me think of someone else. You're, you're not Batman. They're trying to save everybody, right? It's been in the dark cave for about 20 minutes when this happens oh snap oh no oh no i see something yeah 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 honey i'm home did you hear the voice <laughs> Wait a minute, seriously? <laughs> While sitting in the dark, Kachan is a little freaked out when he suddenly hears what sounds like a woman crying from somewhere deep within the caves. Meanwhile, no, maybe maybe outside they were like partying. Maybe they were like, uh, you know, drifting around and the car was like, <laughs> they were pumping brakes. So maybe it's the sound of that. Bruh. <laughs> maybe that's what it was. Waiting back in the car, Yasuke and Daichan also experience something terrifying. Like, Today was your first time with us. How was it? Is that a guy or a girl? Uh, voice sounds like a guy. I had goosebumps. Because it was a cave. Nah, that's a guy. Damn, looks like a chick though, you know? Holy, looks like a chick. Bro, I'm getting confused right now, man. This this era is crazy, bro. Like, there were so many bats. Damn, that's why I said Batman is gonna come to rescue. Or he's not gonna, or maybe he's gonna this time, yeah. If I said he's not gonna come to rescue, he's definitely gonna come to rescue. Bats are his friend. Let's start another pandemic. <laughs> Yay! 
Did you see it? No. Someone can be seen sitting right outside the passenger seat window, Yo. just watching Daichan and Yasuke. Oh my god. Yo, I was like dead ass I was gonna point out. Like I was looking at this, I was like, well, it feels like that's something. But then I was like, it's the car mirror or something, so I was like, nah, okay, whatever, right? Like I dead ass was gonna point that out though. Nah, yo. Stop the cap. No, dead ass, bro. I was gonna point that out, bro. I was gonna point that out, but holy, so these are the eyes, bro. That's looking crazy though. Then there are two loud bangs, one from the back of the car and one from the front. As the camera pans back toward the passenger window, we can see that the creepy figure seems to have disappeared. But that's not all that happened that night. Because early on, back in the caves, there was something else. Like what? While the clip store team are all climbing down the rocks, their viewers pointed out that something else might have been there with them. Watch Damn. again very closely. Maybe here? We saw the hand reveal like that. They saw the hand reveal. I mean, come on, bro. Can I bro get a bigger reveal than <laughs> Yo, if you get a big reveal though, I would be freaking out though. Everybody would be freaking out. Just hand reveal. Someone or something can be seen moving up above them. As if following them to What if it was a bat just like down into the caves? But the clip store guys don't see or hear anything mm, but now so could it be that they had an encounter with the strange apparition of the woman in white that haunts this area let me know what you think you can watch this <laughs> entire investigation over on the youtube channel clip store damn so they really be graveyard shift TikTok user Veronica is working the night shift on the second floor of the Baylor Scott and White Medical Center in Rowlett, Texas. Suddenly, they start to experience something truly creepy. You have to listen very closely. Night nice shift at the hospital. Did you hear her? Yes. You hear her? I don't. So I see them so we can work them up. We work them up. I did not. Maybe, maybe one of the nurses was like just filming a TikTok or something, you know? Don't they, don't, don't nurses film TikToks nowadays? Like, it, it was probably a nurse just like doing those dance moves, shaking the kick and just putting that on the internet for everybody to see for free on the TikToks, right? Yeah, I was probably a nurse like that, though. She probably thinks I'm her mom. She walked, she walked hella slow. <laughs> Bruh. She walked hella slow, bro. Uh, I'm sorry, but I, I had to, man. I had to. Ching it, ching it, ching it. Walk a little faster, man. Walk a little faster, man. Don't you have places to be? You got some places to be, bro. Like, come on, man. You gotta walk faster. Bro. That was you. No, I swear to God. Was that something? <laughs> I think somebody's Veronica and her co-workers hear the sound of someone humming or singing. Did you hear her? Uh, yes. Bruh, like it's, it's probably like another nurse that's like humming. It, 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 you know what I'm saying? Next. You hear her? Next. That Night shift worker Veronica explains that she believes that several ghosts haunt the Baylor Hospital. But oh, she that? says that one of them, the ghost of a young girl, can often be heard laughing and singing throughout the hallways, Dang. as if trying to reach out to the staff. 
So is the hospital haunted by the spirit of a young girl? Let me know what you think. The Mysterious Mannequin This next eerie clip was posted by TikTok user The Truth 444 The video shows a tourist in Paris stopping at the storefront of the famous and very controversial brand Balenciaga. The woman notices something in the store window that is truly disturbing. Emily Watson? Okay, I thought it was good. It said Emma Watson for some reason. What's your thoughts on this? Okay, people, tell me something. So this... So this is a store in Paris. Okay, so the head is gonna turn, right? Okay, people, tell me something. So something. this is a store in Paris. I'll tell you something. A store in Paris. Paris. This is a man's store in Paris. Yeah. And this is a, a um, mannequin that they say nice. that... Damn, though, it looks kind of realistic, but still, like, yeah, it's a mannequin. It looks like AI. Yeah, robot, uh, with fake skin on it. They made this <laughs> and put this in the store. This boy look like somebody dead and bomb. Look at his hand. Wait, I'm doing it through the hole. Yo. Look at the boy hands. I feel like that we're just gonna see the eyes turn though, like. Look, the hands. His hands. His hands is as real as mine. The woman is freaked out by a mannequin that looks just a little bit too real. Yeah. But things are about to get even weirder. Ow, 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 ow. But, but here's the thing, right? Technology is advancing too, though. Technology is advancing. Maybe it's because of that now, nah, bro. Like, come on, man. Yeah, it's advancing. But I've seen uh, AI robots. Uh, you know that Sophia robot for, uh, in particular? definitely was looking a bit like this you know the eyes are completely soulless because yeah sure uh it's a robot right but the fake skin looks kind of like it closely if anybody have this guy missing please so this is crazy i've never seen anybody look so freaking real how if i have this man in other store sit on look give it give like five ten years you're definitely gonna see a lot of that crap you're definitely gonna see a lot of like ai robots walking around maybe like 20 years maybe not like five ten years ten years probably i think it's very possible we're gonna see a whole lot of ai walk around like i'm talking i mean we already have ai but i mean like ai robots Look at I that. Think the hand what you see what? this this is freaking oh, crazy look at this Bro, 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 bro. Did she like change the angle or did that like Sika change his uh, face direction a little bit? I said they made this mannequin and put clothes on him and have him sit down in the window. Look bruh, at the bruh. guy freaking face. He's in Paris. If you know anyone that missing a black son, look like this. He's in Paris in the store in the window. The mannequin <laughs> suddenly appears to be looking directly. Black son missing Bruh. Like, Bruh, come on man. Oh man. Whose son is that, bro? Are you missing any black son? Yeah, here you go take it. I mean damn bro. Like that lady crazy though. That lady crazy. I've never seen anybody look so freaking real. But okay, let's hear his explanation. Look like this? I th yeah, he changes face face direction, like uh, clearly. He's in Paris in the store in the window. The mannequin suddenly appears to be looking directly at the woman. Viewers of the video are creeped out by the sudden change in position and some- Yeah, bro, like, I was hella creeped out, too. Like, deadass, though. Like, I- I mean, it, to be honest, I was anticipating it. Like, I was expecting that, but- but still. Like... Even swear, they could see the mannequin blinking. The video gets a massive amount of attention as viewers begin to make wild claims that the multi-billion dollar fashion brand Balenciaga has embalmed one of their models and that the mannequin isn't a mannequin at all but is in fact a missing model by the name of Christopher Tyler. The claims become even stronger after Christopher Tyler seems to drop offline. He oh stops modeling and mysteriously his Instagram account is suddenly set to private. Whoa. People became so disturbed by the ultra lifelike mannequin's resemblance to model Christopher Tyler that Chris had to actually post an Instagram live addressing that he was safe and 
actually very much alive. Oh, like, I appreciate everybody concerned, but, you know... It's just a creepy video, though. That's all. Like, there is no, like, super... You don't need to look too deep into it. It's just a creepy video. That's it. That's all. You can't feed into whatever you see on the internet. Nah, you a clone, bro. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a big pain. <laughs> they killed me. Everything. Everything in the book. Everything in the book. You're but close, all of this really doesn't explain why this creepy mannequin seems to stare at this tourist who gets too close. I, I think, like, yeah, it creeped me out too, and uh, but but I think she just moved a little bit, right? Like she probably changed her direction too drastically, or maybe not. Maybe maybe not. I don't know, man. Listen, I, I don't have the answers, but I click on this video on the screen. Check this out. The night is still young, my brothers. Check it out, my brothers. Don't let your dogs out. Maybe that knock is a sign that you should not open your door. All right, I'll see you there.